I am Dr. Shakti Prakash Srivastava, Assistant Professor, Department of Geology, PPNPC College, Kanpur. My topic is obesity. O obesity, Latin overder means overeat. The word obesity come to English from Latin, where the word overder means overeat. What is obesity? Obesity is defined as excessive body fat that increase our risk of other health problems. Obesity is not just a cosmetic concern, it is a medical problem that lead to incre increment in the risk of other disease and health problems such as heart disease, diabetes, high blood pressure and certain cancer. It is a chronic health condition and can be diagnosed using a person's BMI. If a person's weight is at least 20%, higher, then it should be he or she is considered obese. The bait may come from muscle, bone, fat, and body water. What are its symptoms? Body mass index, BMI, is an estimate of body fat and a good gauge of your risk for disease that can occur with more body fat, BMI is often used to diagnose obesity. To calculate BMI, we divide weight in kilograms by height in meter squared. BMI under 18.5 underweight health risk minimal. BMI 18.5 to 24.9 normal weight health risk minimal. 20, 30 to 34.9 OS high health risk, 30 to 39.9, severely always health risk very high, 40 and over morbidly always health risk extremely high. Other symptoms of obesity, one of the most obvious sign and symptoms of obesity is of course excess weight and large waist circumference. There are also a number of other signs and symptoms of obesity in children and adults, which can be used in conjunction with an individual BMI to identify obesity. Shortness of breath, snoring, joint pain and back chest, unable to cope with physical activity, increased preparation, perceptions, feeling, lethargic every day. These obesity symptoms in children and adult stem from the effect of excess weight of the body. If the condition is left ignored, it will lead to several other conditions like depression, gallbladder disease, cancer, 
and heart disease. Being obese is also linked to premature death. Hence, the treatment of morbid obesity and the treatment of childhood obesity is crucial. What are its causes? Although there are genetic, behavioral, metabolic, and hormonal influence of body weight, obesity occur when we take in more calories than we burn through normal daily activities and exercise. Our body stores these excess calories as fat. Obesity usually results from a combination of causes and contributing factors. Unhealthy diet is that an increased intake of energy dense food that are high in fat and sugar. Fiscal inactivity to increasingly sedentary nature of many forms of work. Changing modes of transportation and increasing urbanization. Factors resulting in development of obesity. In the condition of obesity, excess fat get stored because there is an imbalance in the supply and expenditure of calories in the body. The factors related to its development are as follows. First, age. Obesity is more prevalent in middle-aged people but it can happen at any stage of life. If obesity occurs in childhood and adolescence, then it is more likely to occur in adulthood. Second, inheritance. In many families, the tendency of obesity is found in line A the pattern of eating and drink, drinking and fix, physical activity is more influenced by social and cultural factors and is transmitted from one generation to another. Third, endocrine factors. Endocrine factors on body fat can be observed on both normal physiological and pathological conditions. Calories supply. If a person becomes used to taking more amount of calories, then more fats get stored in the body. Causes of obesity. Sedentary lifestyle. Unhealthy dietary proteins. Psychological, frequency of eating, physiological, inactive, genetic. Common health consequence of obesity. Raised BMI is major risk factor for the following disease. First, cardiovascular disease, mainly heart disease and stroke. Second, diabetes. Musculoskeletal disorder, especially osteoarthritis, a highly disbalancing degenerative disease of the joints. Some cancer, including endometrial, liver, gallbladder, kidney, and colon. Liver disease. Arthritis, diabetes, cancer, heart disease, hypertension, consequences of obesity. Effect of obesity. 
overweight people are more likely to have a serious disorder called sleep apnea where breathing stop during sleep this is because the excess far around the lungs and neck can put pressure on the airways and lower lungs capacity which cause the issues with breathing this is one of the dangerous effects of obesity in the body obesity can result in depression that emanates from social isolation and brings feeling of guilty and shame obvious people find the difficult to do tasks that they could enjoy earlier this causes them to avoid social event and thus impacts their quality of life the effect of obesity of health are quite serious fact about overweight in 2019 an estimated 38.2 million children under the age of 5 years were overweight in 2016 more than 1.9 billion adults aged 18 year and older were overweight of these over 650 million adults were overweight in 2016 39% of adults is 18 years and over 30% of men and 40% of women were overweight overall about 13% of the world adult population 11% of men and 15% of women were overweight in 2016 the worldwide prevalence of obesity nearly tripled between 1975 and 2016 who response world health organization who global strategy on diet physical activity and health describe the action need to support healthy diet and regular physical activity the strategy call upon all stakeholders to take action at global regional and local level to improve diet and physical activity pattern at the population level the 2030 agenda for sustainable development recognize non communicable disease as a major challenges for sustainable development pro tip for uh, from dietitian in intermittent fasting which involve involves an eating pattern with short term fasting where meals have to be eaten within a shorter time window during the day proper fiber intake help in the digestion process and creates a feeling of fullness eating fresh fruit vegetables whole grains pulse low fat and low carbohydrate food can help us in losing weight maintaining good gut bacteria which can improve digestion and aid weight loss probiotic and prebiotic food can aid growth of healthy gut bacteria stress management help to suppress hormones such as adrenaline and cholesterol that can promote 
emotional eating prevention exercise encourage physical activity skip saturated fat proper sleep slat based diet avoid processed food conclusion obesity indeed a major health concern because the health complication are very serious the management of obesity revolves around diet and physical activity and so it important to remain fit more people diet of too much of food then of too little acknowledgement i would like to acknowledge the study material from book and various website that i took the help of in making this presentation thanks